Good afternoon. It is 2 p.m. on Tuesday, the 10th of September, and it's time for Today in My Bujo. So, how are you? Are you missing Daryl? I know I am. It's really weird to do the intro without him shouting the, the, the lines, you know? But yeah, it's just, it's just weird. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> I have to turn that light on. The sun's suddenly gone in, so it's gotten a bit darker all of a sudden, you know. Oh, wow, there you go. So, yes, I did my night care last night. Um, I did day face cream, I wore makeup, I did the challenges, I did not have any booze, um, I had less than one can, I had chips, I did not craft. Uh, about to take a uh, just double check that I did about today. Yes, I did. I wrote shopping. Okay. So we'll do that in a minute. We did that last night. Yep. So we need my steps. So are you having a good um, a good day? Today is Daryl's second day at uh, big school. He was very tired when he came home yesterday. He was a bit grumpy as well which um, I kind of expected and he was like overhyped so uh, I stuck him in the bath and got him all calmed down and that and he was a bit like you know he's I think it's the going in without me that he's not liking because he's liking school but he's you know creating when I drop him off and I think it's it, it's purely for my benefit I know that but it's not nice when he does it and it's it's upsetting you know you don't Nobody likes to have their child pulled away while they run for it. Um, and he was absolutely fine about going until he got there. And then he was like, but mummy. Oh, I said, no, nope, no, nope, go on, off you go. Oh, but I want you to go. Oh, I said, oh, please don't do this to me. And I was like, go on, off you go, give me a kiss. Mom. See you later, have a really good day and all this. Stuff. He's like, but mum. And it's like, oh, God, you know. Right, okay. So, Tuesday. <laughs> I have done the loo, I have done the office, I have vacuumed downstairs and I vacuumed upstairs which I do on Sundays. So I'm going to put that in as last Sunday. Um, I've done Daryl's table, I've checked the cupboards and the fridge in preparation for the bins going out tonight. So yeah, I've, I've had a busy, busy day. I've been at home all day. It's been, well, I went down to see my mum this morning and then I've been home since then. Um, just, you know, catching up on stuff that I like to watch on the telly. The novelty. And uh, yeah, I've just filled that in in the wrong fucking pen. Oh, fuck my life. Fuck it. I get to do it so late in the day right so I've done doe face cream and I've got makeup on that's about as far as I've got at the moment I have tea dyed a whole stack of paper and envelopes and stuff I need to make a load of uh, fancy envelopes as well because plain envelopes are all very nice but I like fancy ones you know, like with, um, I've got a template from it'll come to me. Genevieve, Genevieve Designs. I've got one of her templates to make a um, really nice envelope. I've already made it once on tea dyed paper. But this is the front of it, but that's isn't that lovely? Look at that. And you just. Fold it all together like that, stick that bit in place. I think that's gorgeous. I really, really like that. So I'm actually gonna add that to my stack over there so they can go with my journaling supplies. I've also got these little ones that I got. I tend to sort of keep like little bits of dies when I get a small die set for a stamp set, lawn fawn especially because they're tiny, tiny little things. And I tend to put them in these, but you know, I've got a shed load of these I can use as well. So I'm very excited. Right, let's pull a card. Let's. 
I'm doing really crap with the penny a day thing. Did anybody else start that in 2019? Where you like add a penny each day. So you, on the first day you save a penny, on the second day you save two pennies, on the third day you save three pennies, and then on like December 31st you save £3.65. And you basically increase it every day. And um, yeah, I, I know I'm not, I haven't done anywhere near enough, about a month behind. So I need to uh, my next get paid. Chuck a load in. I did like real quick last month, just in one go to try and catch it up. Where is it? There we go. So yeah, I've only coloured in 182 blocks, and I should have done 234, and that was on 24th of August. So I've got another seven days to add on to that. Another 17 days to add on to that. So I'm quite behind. Yeah, so I should have 234, um, 241, 251 blocks as of today. And I've only got 182. Damn. But I filled in most of the like more expensive ones down here. Like basically the bottom five rows. So everything in the three pound um three pound and more is is done. I've already saved for that, which is awesome. Because I decided I would do that. I would save the higher amounts now rather or earlier in the year rather than sort of five minutes before Christmas when I've got a small boy turning five and <laughs> you know so judgment is number 20 and it's exactly what it says on the tin don't judge if you have been judging stop it you don't know what other people's circumstances or situation are you don't know what other people are going through if you feel you are being judged do you know what ignore them honestly they they are just not worth it I mean see here you see um, she's walking away but she's looking back at this and you've got this woman here she's got quite heavy makeup on her shirt appears to be open because he's having a bloody good look and he and she's obviously pissed you know and um, this woman here is judging. Look at her judging. But look at what she, you know, what she's going to. She's going to an angel, you know. Um, don't be this woman. Don't judge. You don't know where, what's going on in this woman's life, you know, or what they're both going through. I mean, he's drinking too. Don't be that person. And if you are by all means judge secretly in the privacy of your own brain space but nobody else wants to know nobody else cares okay keep it to yourself i put don't assume the worst about people you do not know their situation hurry this up because it's now quarter past two and i'm just going to get daryl in a bit phone shut up um, I did that last night. Okay, so sleep. Five hours and fifty-two minutes. I could not fall asleep last night. It was gone midnight when I finally went to sleep. Oh, it was fucking twelve. I was so tired, and then my alarm woke me up at like six. So you know, once I slept, I slept really well. But God, it took me a while to get off. Of course the alarm goes off this morning and you feel like absolute shit warmed up. I can't believe I just coloured all that in with the wrong pen. Ugh. Oh well. We're now up to um, Smackdown's on tonight so I, I won't pick that up until tomorrow but yep, I now know who's going into the final. I'm not surprised. Not surprised. I've got nothing to tick off there, so let's. Go. Oh, look, I got a menu from school yesterday, which is hang on at the bottom of my. I just made a little fold out there for that. Okay. Let's quickly get 
the number in and the weather and then I can get up the road and I'll do the word later on. I feel a bit sorry for Daryl, you know, he went to school in the rain this morning because it was like, well, not raining, but it was not pleasant. And then about an hour after he started school, the sun came out. And it's been gorgeous all day and I'm just about to go and get him out and the sun's gone. But he'll have been outside a lot today, so that's good. So 19 over 13 was the screenshot I took at lunchtime. Let's just pull up the um, thingy. So 06.32 and 7.31 is the thingy. Sunrise, sunset, you know, you know what I mean. Uh, what's the word just out of interest? I've got his umbrella. Right, I don't really have time to do that. I don't know. I could do. Fuck it. I found a set of sepia tone fit artist pit, pit, pit artist pens the other day, and I was like, oh, I might go back and get them because I've got all that lovely tea dyed paper over there. <laughs> I've also um, bought some coffee. Now, I, it, it, if you know me at all well, you will know that I am allergic to coffee. I'm allergic to caffeine, which is why I needed to get off the um, cola so bad. Pardon me. Um, and um, I don't like the smell anyway, it gives me migraines. But I really, really, really want to have a go at coffee dyeing paper because you get darker results. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have a go with that. I'm going to try just um, painting it on rather than having a big smelly pan of coffee. That I've then got to like, dip into. I wonder if I could like diffuse the smell slightly, what do you think? By um, putting essential oils in it or something, I don't know. Anything would be better than the smell of coffee. That's quicker. <laughs> so, there we go. We are all set up. I've done most of today really, because I've done the housework and all that lot, but there we go. Yeah, I don't really have anything to do day wise um, I've still got to create my journal which I'm probably going to do that tomorrow my A6 one at least do that tomorrow during the live I expect just to get it done so yeah there we go I will leave that there um, hope you enjoyed this and I will see you in the evening edition take it easy guys bye evening it is five minutes past eight and um, I'm gonna quickly do an evening edition before I go and have a bath and get an early night because I am shattered in an effort for us to be on time to school and it was a close thing this morning I set my alarm for half past six because I like to have quite a lot of time in the morning to wake up so, day face cream and makeup was done. Challenges were done. I did have a little drinky poos for dinner. Not had caffeine today. A bit of chips. I haven't crafted it. Well, I don't know. I did. I did you know, I teed out a load of paper. I'd say that was crafting, wouldn't you? I made something after all. I made brown paper. <laughs> um, about today. I quite like how that came out. <laughs> I've had a day to myself, it's been lovely. So, I'm going to plan on having a little bit of a soak in the bath in a minute. And, uh, yeah, making that pretty much it. Nice. Okay. My mood has held steady at that. Okay, let's 
been about there. I've done the worktops and I have done the bins. And I swept the floor, yeah. Dishwasher is on. Yeah, the only thing I didn't do was any laundry. Awesome. Busy, busy day. Tomorrow I find out who's going through between Elias and Ricochet. That's pretty much it, guys. So, lunch choices tomorrow. But today he had lasagna with garlic bread. Tomorrow it's roast turkey with roast potatoes and gravy. I don't think he's going to like that. And the following week it's chicken... Uh, for th well, Thursday it's chicken curry. And then fish and chips on Friday. They seem to have fish and chips every Friday. We always used to have fish and chips on Friday. Fish, chips and peas. Yeah, my mum always used to do it on Friday. That's how I, knew, I always knew when I was pregnant, because my mum would cook fish and I would feel sick. And I, I went off fish during all, all of my pregnancy. Isn't that funny? I've only just recently been able to start eating fish again, actually. So... Ah, okay. There we go. Right, so I'm going to do a little bit more journaling. I'm going to upload this, and um, then I'm going to bed. So thank you so much for joining me today. Please feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave us comments and kisses down below because, you know, I love comments, he loves kisses. That's the way it goes. Uh, click this book here in the corner if you have not already done so, and you will be subscribed. And if you hit the bell that then appears down below, you'll be notified when I upload new content. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really, really, really bazillion a percent appreciate it. I will see you in Wednesday's live. We are live tomorrow night, 7.30pm UK time. Do you know what time that is where you live? No? Then look it up. I tell you every bloody week, it's time you looked it up. That's what Google is for. Okay? Look it up and be there. I will set up a thingy my bob to notify you and if you click the little bell on that it will tell you when i go live and i'd really appreciate it if you joined me come along have some fun there will be vodka i've got a, a, a list of things to play with and to do so you know we could do some of it that'd be fun yeah okay take it easy guys